Hello everybody, it is me, Daniels Vlogs here, and it is Friday night. Yes, I'm doing an upload on a Friday night because Saturday, which is tomorrow, I don't have time to do anything tomorrow. I'm busy tomorrow, so I said, you know what? I'm going to do a video today with my wonderful wife. So, say. Hey. And today, we are going to do an unboxing video of the new uh, Guava flavored G Fuel. Um, it pretty much got here quick. Thank you, Gifo, for saying this, and I can't wait to try it. It's sold out on the collector's box. It's sold out. I'm not sure if it is on the tubs yet. It might be. I have to look at it. But, yeah, but this is right here. This is it right here, and I can't wait to show you guys what this looks like. And, yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy this video. But before I get started, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and just let me know what you guys think of this video. All right, so I got my box cutter right here. I want you to get up, cut this open. I can't wait to see this. I'm so pumped about this. Um, guava, isn't guava like a Mexican fruit, right? Yeah. I think so. It's a Mexican it's fruit. Watch out. Here we go. It's a Mexican fruit, and I think that <clears throat> I haven't had guava in like actual guava in a while. I haven't even eaten guava, so. Go so you're not gonna have this because it tastes like. But yeah. Dang, that popped open. That popped open. Dang, G Fuel. Alright, so we popped this open finally. And oh my goodness. First thing we get welcomed with is a blue ice sticker from G Fuel. Thank you, G Fuel. Blue ice is one of the coolest ever. And here it is, y'all. The, the guava inspired by Castro. That is a neat box. Awesome. This is awesome. Look at the back. The <coughs> like yeah. the desert. Yeah, it's so neat. Guys, I'm really pumped about this flavor. The back. You know, I just like the art on this. I love how G Fuel does these collector's boxes. I just never because... a mustache. <laughs> well, yeah, Castro has that cool mustache. True. Um, so, yeah, that's the box right there. And we're about to pop this open to see what's inside the box. We already know what's inside. You got the... The tub and the shaker, the limited edition shaker. So let's pop this thing open. All right, there we go. And there's that. And the first thing that we see is a pink to go scoop. Dude, that's a hot pink too. It is a hot pink. It's neat. That's awesome. It's probably I'd say about like the, the color of that. And then here is the shaker, the limited edition, as what some people say it is. Um, that's why it's already sold out on the G Fuel store. I like the, the color, the pink and the green. Um, I think it was a good idea that they released this literally at the last, like, week of February. Because February is almost over. And this is so cool. I like this shaker. I like the way it was set up. It's one of those see-throughs. And I like see-through cups. So this is one of my favorite cups. Um, so, Yeah. But that's the Castro shaker, and then here is the tub itself, like the, right there, guava flavor. Mm -hmm. And I've heard that this is a really good flavor by a couple YouTubers. They're saying it's one of the one of the good one of their best flavors. So um, we're gonna be doing a taste test at the same time. So I'm gonna put it in this video. I decided I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I'm really pumped to try this. And that's just such a cool design on it. It's really just a cool design. But yeah. And then the last thing I just want to show you guys is the guava juice. I call it guava juice because they got the guava sticker. So it's pretty cool. But yeah. Alright guys, so we're going to get ready to taste test this. Um, I'm really excited to try this. I like the art, like I said. Mm -hmm. um, she's never had guava it's, before. so I It think, looks good. And I plus, think, shout out to Castro. Castro 1021. So, yeah. <clears throat> Just be ready for that, guys. Alright, guys. So, we're about to taste test this. We already got our water cups ready to go, our shakers. We're going to put it in this cup first because it's clear. Um, this one is clear to see through, but it's not as clear as this one. So, we're going to go ahead and pop this open. And we're going to take a smell of the tub. And let's see how it smells. I'm really pumped because I can't wait to try this. Alright, guys. So... There we go. All right. See you. 
Okay, I'll well. have to seal up in my... All right, do you want to smell first or do you smell? I almost thought it was going to jump out at us. Well, I can smell that from here. Whoa. Bro. I can smell it right here, and it's not even... It's about a, what, a foot away or half a foot. I don't even know. Dude, that smells strong, man. I can smell it from right here. Dude, that is strong. Woo! That smells, smells good. Sweet, it does smell very sweet, though. Okay, so we are both pretty nervous about this. I've never, like, it's like I said, it's been a long time since I've had guava, and she's never had it before. But that smell is strong. It mm. pretty much, <laughs> I didn't put it on camera or anything, but it, when I smelt it, some of it went, like, some of the smell went down my throat and it made me cough. So that's how strong this, this, this uh, scent is. I don't recommend smelling it when you first pop it open because you pop it open and there's the smell right there. So <laughs> we're going to go ahead and taste this and uh, let's just see what color it changes and, you know, take a look at this. So we're going to put it in hers first. All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. There you go, baby. Let's see. It's like a pinkish. Yeah, it looks like it's turning pink. It's like turning pink to me. Alright, I'm putting mine maybe in my capture light cup. Light pink and dark pink, maybe. Alright, my turn to put mine in. There we go. Let's look now. And that's before sinking it. Put that top right on there. There you go. That's what that looks like. That's not all the way shaken up. Mm hmm But yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. Alright, so we got our drinks ready. Shaken up already. Um, I'm shaking mine a little bit more because this is a stronger smell to it. So it might be a little bit stronger. So uh, the best time for you to shake it is between one minute to two minutes. Um, just because it gets all the powder and stuff. As you can tell, there's no powder on mine. And it's just like you want to be able to uh, get the powder shaken up. So and I'm ready to go. I'm good. I think mine's good. Mm. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. So we're going to pop these open. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to smell the cup. Now that smells different than it did when we smelled the pub. It's not as strong as what's in the tub. Just like I said, that's, that's why you. Pear. That's why. That's what I'm saying. That's why you want to shake it before you drink it because it gets the flavor down. All right, guys. Well, you know what's gonna happen now. We're good about to bottom up on this, but before we do, that smells so good. That really does smell good. But before we do, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, make sure you guys uh, stick around. I got an update for you. Alright guys, so let's get ready to drink this. It smells good. I'm going to shake it one more time just because. Yeah. It's just a little more. Alright. You guys hear that? Ooh, that smells so good. I know. Alright guys, let's get ready to this in 3, 2, 1, drink. <laughs> That's good. What? Mm-hmm. How is the strawberry in that? That's what, it's, it's good, isn't it? It's really good, guys. Now you tell me. When you pop this tub open, it smells strong. And it, it hits you. But you get in your shake cup and you start drinking it, it's just like, whoa. That's refreshing. I know. That's good for, like, the spring and summertime. I know, right? And, wow. Gee, feel my man. Oh, man. Oh. oh. I don't know, man. This might have to take my new spot. And currently my number one spot right now for the G Fuel is Hype Sauce. I don't know. That's that's how good this is. I will have to do a uh, a top five favorite G Fuel flavors uh, sometime next month. And let you guys know because, you know, March is coming up. And spring is just around the corner here. So they might be coming out more spring flavors. But this, for Mexican fruit, is really good. It, it definitely tastes really refreshing you can take that to work with you if you work outside and it'll, it'll quench you oh man that's good bro guys <laughs> chief of buddy and castro buddy this flavor 
is fire. Oh, I can't stop drinking it, dude. This is what you got me doing, Fuel? Mmm. That's so good. Ah. I can literally sit here all day and talk to you guys and drink this flavor. This flavor is good. I recommend you guys get you some. Yes, when you get the tub and you pop it open, it has that strong, and it, yes, it's going to smell bad, but me, personally, it does not smell bad. It just kicks you. It just punches you in the face when you first pop it open and smell it. But you put it in your shaker cup with water, with really good water that we that you use. Shake this for shake the crap out of this for about a minute or two. Mm -hmm. Drink on it, mm -hmm. and you're like, bruh. <laughs> <laughs> your face. It's the point, though. Like, guys, please get you some. I think he's about to drink that whole thing in one sitting. Mm. That's how, he looks. He looks. I'm, I hardly even see that face. Mm. But anyway, guys, that's pretty much it for the unboxing and the taste test. Um, I really enjoyed it. Um, tastes really good. Life is great, man. Life is good. Mm. Like I said, guys, they are currently out of the collector's boxes. They're sold out, but their tubs are still available. So go pick you up some. Um, it's good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and rate this a 9.5 out of 10. Yes. So it's way up there. Way up there. So, mm. excuse you. Excuse me. Guava. It has to be. Has it's to be really, guava. really good, guys. I would definitely let you guys recommend you guys try this flavor out. Just because I want you guys to experience it yourself. With the surprise the smell that it had and the delicious, refreshing taste to it. But, anyway, guys. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I had a great week. I hope you guys did too. And make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. But before I go, here's that little update for you. So yeah, the new flavor that's coming out in March. They already announced the next flavor. Um, they already came out with this flavor. They got another one coming out. And they're teaming up with Doom. The game Doom, if you guys heard of it. I'm sure that a lot of people have heard of it. It's been around for so many years, since what, the 80s and 90s, around there. So, it could be called Spicy Demonade. So, it's going to have some cayenne pepper in it. And so, lemonade. And lemonade. So, that's going to be coming out sometime in March. I can't remember the initial release date, but I saw they posted it. Um, and it's going to be something I'll probably get, definitely, because I want to try it. It's probably going to be spicy, because there's some cayenne pepper in it. So, I mean, there's no, it's, that's the reason why it's called Spicy Demonade. Um, so... But other than that, guys, that's pretty much it. If you guys want to check out the leak of the spicy demonade, I'll put the link in the description down below. It will also lead to G Fuel's uh, YouTube channel. You can subscribe to them and watch their updates. And also subscribe to me. And make sure you guys turn on that bell icon so you don't miss a single update. And I appreciate every, every single one of y'all. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Peace. Have a great weekend. Mm.